So enjoy this footage. We went high five crazy. Most people gave me a high five. A couple people dissed me, and I got a nice picture with some lovely ladies. It was Peter's idea. Three more medals for Canada. Three more medals for Canada. No one, no one, no one. Anyone high five? I assure you, there's no way this person is going to deny me a high five. Watch this. Three medals for Canada tonight. Oh yeah. Oh, thank you. Delivery. You gotta make eye contact. Oh, sure. You, you wanna be in it? Yeah. With me? Oh, awesome. I will never deny a picture of beautiful women. Oh, oh, I got it all the video. Oh, wow. Got it. What a voice. Church, all for the church. That's it. Yeah, there you go. Yeah, that's why Peter was there. So yeah, he was, he was they're there, there with me. Yeah, exactly. Or he's make sure they didn't do anything to me. So I'm pretty sure Peter also has a girlfriend. I see it right here. He's already got his hand up. Watch this. trouble. Canada, U.S. Sunday. You're going down. Hi, everyone. It is Friday, February the 26th. It's the evening. It's a big day for a few reasons. It's the first time I'm doing two of these vlogs in one day, so that's pretty exciting. I'm also excited because my friend Megan is filming. She is a much nicer person to talk to and much more responsive than the tripod that I'm used to using. And thirdly, it was a huge day for Canada, securing four medals today. Day 15 of the Winter Olympics is wrapped up. Just two more days to go. And Canada is now in third in the medal hunt. I'll get to those totals in a couple minutes. We started off with our women's curlers. They won a silver medal, losing a heartbreaker to Team Sweden in 11 ends. But we're proud of Cheryl Bernard. I think she's the skip and the rest of her team. Then in the men's speed skating, we secured a gold medal and a bronze medal. Gold went to Charles Hamlin. Bronze went to Francois Louis Tremblay. I practiced that one. Good job. And then they topped it off with a gold medal in the 5,000 meter relay also in speed skating. So a huge day for us with two gold, one silver, and one bronze. We got some cool footage from downtown today. Just before everything started, we saw this drum line. They're from Sardis High School in Chilliwack. They're representing doing some hip hop and some R&B songs. I didn't know any of the titles, but I knew the tunes. Actually, they weren't even hip hop or R&B. That's how out of touch I am. <laughs> they did some pop songs and some R&B, some hip hop, who knows? Just watch the video. I'm sure you'll recognize the songs better than I did, but they was kind of cool. Nice way to lift our spirits in the rain.
Also tonight, it was the big semi-final game. After U.S. crushed Finland, it was Canada's turn. After a quick 3-0 lead, they had to hold on to hold off the Slovaks 3-2. But nonetheless, Canada is in. Captain Canut, Roberto Luongo, back stopping them to the win. Then, after Canada dismantled the Slovakian team, we ran outside to celebrate that win. And of course, all the medals of the day. I ran outside with the whiteboard, the famous YMO whiteboard, the one that has the medal count. And it read 10 gold, 7 silver, 4 bronze for a total of 21 medals, vaulting us in the third place in the medal standings. And then we had Megan, she was taking some pictures. We had Marie doing the filming. And we had Peter Muscle Maxwell. Just in case anyone got a little too close to me or anyone said anything mean to me, he was there to provide the bouncing skills. This is Peter Muscle Maxwell. He provided the bodyguard services out there. I attempted to. How do you describe that scene? Uh, nothing short of the dog show. And why is that, brother? Uh, well, there was a crazy guy with a sign, uh, kind of short, bald, Japanese, Chinese. Good looking? No. Yeah, I, I, did, I saw that guy too. Yeah. Okay. Good looking? No. <laughs> <laughs> Miss Megan, taking pictures? Yes. Did you snap anything good? I think I hope so. It was a bit dark out there and a bit rainy. But... Dark and rainy. Jacob, what are you doing? I don't know. <laughs> You're playing Find the Dot. Find the Dot here. <laughs> and it's black. Ready? Let's see it. Set. Go. This game's called Find the Black Dots. And oh, hole. That one. That one. My no, the hole. Uh... Yes, that is how we keep ourselves busy here at the Catholic Hospitality Center. And now it's Canada versus U.S. rematch on Sunday. The dream final that everyone wants, especially after the U.S. beat Canada last Sunday. So one week later, there's no doubt that the result is going to be reversed. Ottawa, get ready. Get ready to lose on that bet. Get ready to use A at the end of every sentence. Get ready to sing our national anthem. There's no way that Canada is going to let us down. We look forward to more medals for the last two days, Saturday and Sunday. God bless and go Canada go.